Hey guys, it's Pink Giratina and today I'm back for another video. Today it's a Splatoon 2 update video. Um, if you guys can remember, they said that there will be no new weapons coming to Splatoon 2 after that December update like a month ago. Well, they kind of did tell the truth and they did that at the same time because we have some new, old new weapons I should say. Old new weapons coming to Splatoon 2 which are from Splatoon 1, the um, Sheldon picks collection yep we gained some of those weapons but not all of them and i'll explain to you guys why in a minute okay like i said earlier not all weapons from sheldon's picks from splatoon 1 will make the transition over to splatoon 2 but the ones that are coming to splatoon 2 are the bamboozler 14 mk3 fresh quiffer permanent ink brush soda slasher aerospay pg cherry h3 nozzle nose grim range blaster heavy splatoon remix ends up 83 and explosion maddox 7. so those 10 weapons i just listed will definitely be imported into splatoon 2. Now for the other um, Sheldon pick weapons that won't be implemented into Splatoon 2, they are mostly not being implemented because their Kensa counterparts are already there so it would make sense to put two um, of the same kind of weapons into the game. So the excluded weapons are the Berry Splash Shop Pro, Refurbished Mini Splatling, Tempered Dynamo Roller, Roller Wasabi Splatter Shot, Bento Splatter Shot Splat Charger, Benzo Splatter Scope and the Koro Koro Splat Roller. Now, personally, I am disappointed because I wanted the Berry Splatter Shot Pro, be Pro because, you know, there's that one piece of like gear, the jacket that kind of matches that weapon and I wanted to like match with it. I was hoping they would bring it, but we already have the Kensa Splatter Shot Pro. I personally like the Refurbished Mini Splatting, but since the Kensa Mini Splatting exists, the, it doesn't make sense to have two of those and the one I'm very devastated about which was my main weapon in Splatoon 1 that I used to use and this wreck everybody with was the Wasabi Splatter Shot and because the Kensa Splatter Shot exists they are not putting that into the game but I'm excited that they're actually bringing even though they're not brand new weapons I'm happy they're porting some of it into you know like we have a bigger weapon selection now than we had before even if it's old old weapons from the first game I'm really excited for that but that's pretty much for this update video for Splatoon 2. If you guys are excited for the new ports from Splatoon 1, the weapons from Sheldon's Picks, please make sure to hit that like button. If you guys do enjoy Splatoon 2 content, make sure to subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in the next video.